Fala caras, do outro lado da telinha John John voltando aqui com Minecraft da Telltale Games O primeiro episódio, novamente quero deixar o meu muito obrigado ao meu amigo, meu irmão de coração Edson Júnior por ter me dado esse presente de aniversário, meu amigo você, você é show de bola, muito obrigado mesmo um, essa vai ser então a primeira gameplay, o primeiro, primeiro contato com o episódio 1 do Minecraft E sem maiores delongas vamos lá para jogar e entrar aqui no mundo de Minecraft Segundo a Telltale Games Escolher aparência de personagem Legal, você tem seis aparências aqui você tem esse menininho aqui com um detalhe laranja no cabelo, um macacão, uma camiseta vermelha. Tem esse outro aqui de macacão marrom, camiseta verde. Esse aqui é bem, o, bem a cara do, do personagem do Minecraft mesmo, né? se eu não estou enganado. Eu estou tentando lembrar agora como é que é o visual em primeira pessoa do... Quando você entra no jogo Minecraft, no jogo original, tem uma partezinha lá onde você vai colocando aos poucos equipamento nele. Eu tô tentando lembrar, eu acho que ele é mais parecido com esse aí. Aí você tem esse aqui, esse moreninho aqui com detalhe azul. Tem esse outro aqui, que já tem uma camiseta branca e suspensórios amarelos. Suspensórios verdes. Ah, mas vai ser esse. Vai ser esse. E o pior é que eu achei ele parecido comigo. Isso que é o pior. E você tem esse outro aqui. Esse aqui tem mais cara de... Não sei, ele me lembrou um pouco um japonesinho. Esse aqui tem um suspensório vermelho e camiseta branca. Eu vou com esse aqui de suspensórios verdes, camiseta preta e calça kaki. Vambora. A Ordem da Pedra. Iniciar episódio 1. Um. Vamos lá. Nothing built can last forever, and every legend, no matter how great, fades with time. With each passing year, more and more details are lost until all that remains are myths. Half-truths, to put it simply, lies. And yet, in all the known universe, between here and the Far Lands, the legend of the Order of the Stone endures, unabridged as self-evident fact. Indeed, it is only a troubled land that has need for heroes, and ours was fortunate to have so long ago. Four heroes such as these. Gabriel, the warrior, before whose sword all combatants would tremble. Eligard, the redstone engineer, whose machines would spark an era of invention. Magnus the rogue, who would channel his destructive creativity for the benefit of all. And Soren, the architect, builder of worlds, and leader of the Order of the Stone. These four friends together would give so much to gain their rightful place as four heroes. Their greatest quest would take them on a dangerous journey to fight a mysterious creature known as the Ender Dragon. In the end, the Order of the Stone emerged victorious and the dragon was defeated. Their story complete, they slipped away into the pages of legend. But when one story ends, another one begins. Would you rather fight a hundred chicken-sized zombies or ten zombie-sized chickens? Yeah. Just to be clear, you wouldn't have any weapons yeah. or armor, so you'd have to fight them with your hands. That's easy. I'll take the, the, the little tiny little zombies. A hundred of them. Crawling all over you with their tiny hands. Uh, 
All I need is like a shovel. I'm telling you, way too easy. So I've got a daylight sensor on the roof. Mm -hmm. And if I did this right, these lamps should turn on once it gets dark. Mm -hmm. I didn't want to just leave Ruben here with nothing while we're at the building competition. He's coming with us. Really? <laughs> what kind of question huh. is that? Of course he okay. is. Okay, I'm not saying he shouldn't come. I'm not. But don't you think it's a little weird that you take him with you everywhere you go? He kind of makes us look like, I don't know, amateurs. He's my wingman. People always want to talk to the guy with the pig. You mean talk about the guy with the pig. Like, look at the weird guy with the weird pig. How weird. I didn't mean anything by it. I'm glad he's coming. I just don't want to give people one more reason to call us losers. I'm getting tired of it. I'm tired of being a laughing stock. Who cares what other people think? I know. I'm just... It wears you down. You say you're not a loser, Olivia. So win. Okay. Fine. Did you hear that? Oh, no. Boom! <laughs> You guys totally freaked out. That was uh... Axel, what's the matter with you? Great. Now I'm gonna smell like a pig in Endercon. I thought we were buddies. Cool mask. It is, isn't it? Yeah, very convincing. <laughs> the look on your faces. Did you bring the fireworks? Of course I did. I even brought something for the little guy. Nice. You brought Reuben a disguise? Um, we're going to a convention. Somebody's got to wear a costume. As long as Reuben is happy, I'm happy. Happy? Well, zippity doo da. Okay, relax. It's fine. You definitely brought the fireworks, right? Yes, I'm ready. Waiting on you guys. See, now he's your wingman. Stop. Hurry up and grab your stuff. We'll meet you downstairs, okay? Okay. Cara, que que legal você tá dentro de Minecraft, só que ah uh, Como é que é? Ah, tá. Se eu segurar isso aqui, ele anda mais rápido. Beleza. Que legal tá dentro de Minecraft, só que no jogo da Telltale, muito, muito bom. Aqui tá o Ruben, que é o porquinho. Nossa, quantas memórias de, de construção de Minecraft estão me vindo na cabeça. Muitas, muitas e muitas e muitas. Quantas casas na árvore eu já não criei em Minecraft. Vixe. Shears definitely taking these. Never know when I might need to shear some sheep. One of these days, we're gonna win the Endercon building competition. And when we do, people will look at us and say, hey, there goes Jesse and Ruben, winners of the Endercon building competition. They really should change the name. Faz um tempinho já que eu não jogo Minecraft. Faz um tempinho, um bom tempinho. A última vez foi, acho que 2011. É, eu acho que a última vez foi 2011. Então, se tiver algumas referências mais recentes a Minecraft, provavelmente eu não entendo. Mas vamos ver o Ruben aqui, o porquinho. Give me a dragon roar, Ruben. That'll do, Ruben. That'll do.
Gabriel the Warrior. You think we'll ever get that famous? It's not impossible. Maybe I'll get famous for my sweet poster collection. Então vamos usar o alçapão aqui e sair da casa da árvore. Olha que legal isso. That's everything. Let's roll. Yeah, dude. Roll. Let's go. I heard a pretty juicy rumor about the building competition, but you guys have to promise not to say anything. Okay. Also, it's in two parts. Each part more exciting than the last. Spit it out, Axel. Part one. The special guest at this year's Enercon is none other than Gabriel the Warrior, him freaking self. Whoa, what's part two? Part two, according to my sources, the winner of the building competition is going to get to meet him. It doesn't mean anything if we lose. But if we win, oh man, this would make up for all the losing. Meeting Gabriel would be a dream and an honor. Totally. He's awesome. It'd be amazing to meet him. Ruben better be careful in that costume. The last time Gabriel saw a dragon, it didn't end well. So... Does this source of yours make posters for a living? Huh? Yeah, my uh, source uh, doesn't exist. You guys are my only friends. Guys, let's stay focused. We have a competition to win. We never win. And this year we've got Ruben oh. with us. We basically have no chance. Faith, Olivia. What? A little slice, a sliver. A uh, portion, just a little faith. That's all we need. Also, I'm hungry. To win. No, no, I'm with that. All right. Wait a minute, wait a minute. We're thinking about this all wrong. The point of the building competition isn't just to build something. We have to do something to get noticed by the judges. Okay, then. So how do we do this? We don't just build something functional. We build something fun. After we finish the fireworks machine like we planned, then we build something cool on top of it. We might be onto something. If we want to get a reaction out of the judges, you build something scary. So I say we build a creeper. Wouldn't an Enderman be better? I'm more scared of Endermen than creepers. They both have their moments. They're both pretty scary. Then again, you scared the crap out of us with a creeper today. Let's build an Enderman. Ah. Uh... Olivia's thing? Are you whining? No, I was saying awesome. Yeah. I think this is the first time we've decided on something before getting to the competition. Think we've got everything we need? It wouldn't hurt to grab a little more. Let's get to grabbing then. We're so prepared. We can't lose. Cannot. Bring it in. <laughs> Dare to prepare on three. No, no, no. Preparing is daring. No, that's... That's the same thing. Forget it. Uh, team on three. One, two, three. Team! team. Prepare. Ah, <laughs> oh, no credito. <laughs> Só faltou tocar a música do rock. <risos> Muito legal. Muito bom. Dando soco na madeira, né? Bem Minecraft. Nossa, muitas referências. <risos> que legal! Caraca, muitas referências. De filmes. Esse ano vai ser diferente. Eu não estou apenas pronto para construir. Eu estou pronto para ganhar. Bom pão, perdedores. Oh, ótimo. Há Lucas e os ocelotes. 
The rivalry continues. Man, they've got matching leather jackets and everything. So cool. Well, well, well. If it isn't the order of the losers. <laughs> Great. <laughs> the fail squad's here. Lucas, get a load of these losers. Let's go, guys. Name, please. Axel. And uh, how do you do? No, your team name. Team name? We are not ready for this. Somos ordem do porco. Ender sem saída, maníacos do Nether. We're the order of the pig. <laughs> really? Cemented ties to Reuben, or are you making fun of me? Okay, order of the pig. You guys are in booth five. Uh, ah! Ah! <laughs> Ai ai, tô me divertindo demais, tá muito legal Ele tem um ar muito mais light, muito mais infantil, bem lúdico né Muito bom, eu gosto, olha as plaquinhas que você nomeia, nossa, muito legal Esses daqui são os carinhas que provocaram a gente agora, eu acho. Tal da, das jaquetas de onça lá, sei lá. Acho que são eles mesmos. Deixa eu ver o que mais tem pra cá. Eu aposto que muita gente deve estar perguntando assim: ah, por que, que você não escolheu um creeper pra construir? Ou um zumbi? Escolheu logo um, um Enderman? Eu vou dizer por quê. Foi uma escolha bem pessoal. Quando eu jogava Minecraft, eu ficava muito tenso com medo de um creeper chegar e explodir todo o trabalho que eu tinha feito. E ao mesmo tempo eu achava muito engraçado quando isso acontecia, apesar da raiva que eu sentia. E o zumbi tem aquele lance de você estar tá naquelas cavernas à noite, ele faz aquele barulho e tal. Mas por algum motivo que eu não sei explicar, o tal do Enderman me deixava com medo. Então eu não tive muitas dúvidas na hora de escolher. Is that a freaking beacon? They have a freaking beacon? Freaking beacon? That's stained glass. They aren't just building a beacon. They're building a rainbow beacon. We're gonna lose. Close your mouth, Axel. We should probably stop staring at them. Ha ha ha. Look, it's the order of the losers again. <laughs> Good one, Gil. We're just looking. There'll be plenty of time for you all to look at it after it wins and gets shown at Endercon. You're being unpleasant. Maybe not all of you. Endercon doesn't allow outside food or drink. <laughs> I'm talking about your pig. I'm saying he's food. Shut up. What's that? Jesse said, shut up. Do you need to hear it again? I don't know. Maybe. Stop wasting your time, Aiden. We've got work to do. You're lucky I'm busy. Hey, Jesse. Guys. Hey, Petra. How's the build going? Only time will tell, but we're optimistic. Hey, Petra. I forgot to thank you for that nether star. Hey, Lucas. Not a problem. You help these tools? For the right price, I'll help anyone. If you need anything, you know where to find me. None of us know where to find you. Exactly. No hard feelings, guys. And if you're cool with Petra, you're cool with us. So why don't we just forget about all this and, you know, make this about how cool our builds are? May the best team win. Careful what you wish for. We'll see about that. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Endercon Building Competition! The winners of this year's competition will have their build featured at Endercon. The winners will also meet in person Gabriel the Warrior. Ocelot! 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 Whoa, handshake? We don't have a handshake. We'll just make one up. 
We'll call it the... O rap da Redstone, batida do construtor, aperto do grifo chicote do guerreiro. Ah, vamos chicote do guerreiro. And just like that, I'm nervous again. Don't talk like that. We can do this. Just stick to the plan and everything will be fine. This year, the Order of the Pig can't lose. Let's do it. Building starts now. Oh no, a fireworks dispenser. I'm so scared. <laughs> you worry about your build and we'll worry about ours. <laughs> and now, the moment of truth. Here goes nothing. This looks so cool. We'll win this for sure. I gotta admit, this Enderman is sweet. Good call, Jesse. Skies, people are looking at us. Good build, man. What? No way. It's just a bunch of dyed wool. Whoops. Oh no, Ruben's on fire! Ruben, no, come back! It was Aiden, that punk. The lava's getting closer. It's gonna ruin the build. Ruben's going to get lost. We've got to do something. But our build is about to go up in flames. You guys stay and save the build. On it. We've got to cover, Jesse. Be careful. We'll meet up with you at Endercon. Ruben, where are you? Just give me an oink if you can hear me. Ruben, where are you, buddy? Você tem que apertar e segurar o o manchezinho aqui no controle. Hmm, pig tracks. Ruben, I don't want to be out here in the dark. These definitely belong to a pig. Hmm, there's no way Ruben made these on his own. Hey, Ruben, I got a carrot for you. Where are you, buddy? Ruben? Ruben, come here, boy! I hear some pigs. Ruben, are you in there? Stupid pigs. 
Reuben! No, not you guys. Pigs! Hey, all pigs but Reuben, shut up! Answer me! Oh, caracos! Pô, não acreditei que eu... Tá, aí um negócio que eu não tava esperando no jogo no Minecraft até o T era tomar um susto. Mas tudo bem. Vamos lá. Ruben, it's getting scary out here. Ruben, Ruben, oh no, you in there, buddy? Oh, jeez, please don't be toasted, Ruben. you are hey buddy you want a carrot oh I'm so happy to see you Ruben run I think, I think we're good. I think we made it. Caraca! Eu tinha que entrar naquele negocinho de fogo lá. Oh, que legal isso! Nossa, minha espada quebrou. Caraca. Puta merda. You're gonna have to make a run for it, okay? I'll meet you back in town, I promise. Get out of here now! Nossa, lascou. Come on, 
let's get out of the open. I want to show you something. Not that this isn't a really cool, dimly lit tunnel, but how far away is this thing you want to show me? Careful, Jesse. You don't want to get a reputation as a wimp. Y y this isn't my first time in a cave, Petra. Yeah, but have you ever seen a wither skull? Whoa! Fresh from the nether. You're the first person I've showed it to. So, you'd better appreciate this. That's insane, Petra. You could have gotten yourself killed. <laughs> Don't worry so much. I can handle myself. There's this guy I'm meeting up with at Endercon. He's gonna trade me a diamond for it. Being the resident go-getter pays off every once in a while. Literally. Is a wither skull worth that much? <laughs> Are you kidding? For all the trouble I had to go to get it, I should be asking for much more. Wow. Wow what? In a single day, you went to the nether, you killed a wither skeleton. I mean, I did build a super cool statue, but still, it's pretty sweet being you, huh? You know, you could come with me. I mean, if you're too nervous, I totally get it. But I wouldn't mind a little backup. I'd be honored to be your backup. Don't have to make such a big deal out of it. I just said- You could come with me. I know, I was there. It was amazing. Kind of starting to have second thoughts here. You just keep a crafting table down here? Comes in handy. Since that wooden sword of yours got busted- You're giving me a new one? Even better, you can make your own. One stick plus two stones equals one sword. Oh, meu Deus, quantas lembranças. Bom, é, eu vou dar uma parada aqui, dar uma editada e eu continuo então na próxima gameplay já ajudando aqui a aperta, acho que é isso o nome dela. Eu não prestei atenção, estou muito, estou vidrado aqui na história, não, enfim. Aí eu volto aqui para craftar uma, uma espada e continuar aqui dando, sendo, entre aspas, né, o backup, o apoio aqui da Berta. Beleza? Acho que é Berta o nome dela. Se não for Berta, me desculpa. Na próxima eu chamo ela pelo nome certo. Valeu, galera. Até a próxima. Aquele abraço e fui.